the bag, yeah, that's the brand, and we get to the bag. These private standing on business, Eon, all day. Uh, he said by Wednesday. I think we can get. Yeah, I think we can get that. So I should roll. I should definitely roll my put soon down forty five percent. I don't usually answer those questions. Cause I usually put all the rules in play before you get into your into your positions. What's the rule, baby? <laughs> Maybe you asking the question because you just want me to reaffirm the rule, but I want to hear you say the rule because I need y'all to know these rules before you take your trades. I need y'all to know the rules before you take your trades. Okay, that's why I usually do that. All right, I'm okay with calls here. Calls zero DTE 484 strike price. I'm okay with calls here. Now don't you get stupid and take off without me now. Hold on. Don't you do it. You know how they do. Look, you know how they do. Don't you do it. All right. Let's give me, I'll take three. I'm too crazy, man. Come on. Don't do me like that. Don't do me like that. This motherfucker took off without me. Well, come on. All right. We feel. We feel. We feel. All right. So I definitely like the calls on this one. Let's see. You ready to eat? We're good. I'm up 8% already. <laughs> I look, I just look up the screen like, damn, okay, 13%. There it is. 14%. There it is. Come on. This thing moving faster than I thought it would. Okay. We'll take it. We'll take it. 16% up. That's a great trade. It's a great trade. It's a great trade. All right, family. I do think we're gonna have some issues right here. Uh, we got above it. That should hold. So the next area is gonna be maybe right in here, which we kind of already tried to take them out. So I'm actually thinking we can get above those today. I think we can. I definitely think we can. Yeah. Yep. If you miss that entry, it's part of the game, man. That's why I say, like, not everybody's meant to day trade. Okay, I'm up 20% now. All right. Take a screenshot. It's a good day. It's a good day. All right. Like it. Like it. Yeah, that's a great day. Um, I'm gonna let it keep running because I think we can get above. Yeah, there it is. I think we can get above here. I do, I do see this still sellers in there, but we need to break this. If we can get above this here, hold, I think we can go. I think we can go. Uh, this must hold here, maybe. I'd expect that to hold. So if they can hold this box. And uh, long enough to take this box out, it's game time. Uh, Eon, you already know. <laughs> yeah, we moving. We moving. Juice for the day, I know what it is. Juice for the day, I got my, my green juice back rolling. So, um, I went ahead and got back to the apple, uh, green apple, cucumber, uh, spinach, lemon, and then it has the chlorella in it and um, some BCAAs. Got me a little branch chain aminos, right? Because I'm trying to try to keep this muscle. You know, when people see me, I want them to look at me and go, nah, you can't be vegan. You're too big, <laughs> too swole. I just said same. You already know. 
Got to be on it. Same juice you're drinking. Okay, I see y'all. I see y'all. Let's go. Let's go. Breakfast of champions, right? <laughs> but yeah, man, so I'm trying to I'm trying to really like level this thing out. So um, I lost a bunch of weight, got down to a good size, but now I'm building back up so I can be like, you know, be diesel. So the goal is for me personally, if I can do 225, two, maybe 230, like 8% body fat, oh, we're going to be on something. All right. I don't even know if I can do, I, I won't say 225. Maybe if I can get down to like 220, 8%, 8 to 10% body fat, I think I'd be happy with that. That'd give me a good, good size. I'd still be strong as hell. I'd still be able to move the way I, I know I should be able to move. It'd be good. It'd be good. Some more water for the next 82 days. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, Willie said, I'll meet you there. Boking. Okay, let's get it. Let's get it. How much you how much you weighing now, Willie? All right, we're up 25% now. 25%. These sellers are not effing around though. These sellers are not effing around. However, our buyers are holding tough. Buyer, 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 buyer. So this thing is like cracking. It's knocking on the door. Boom. Boom. So they're trying to get, they're trying to knock this door down. You see that? You see that? Look, they're trying to knock that door down. They're like, get the hell out the way. <laughs> there it is. So 27%, 28%. All right. That's good. That's good. Anything above this, I can't look. Anything above here or after this, I can't be liable for. <laughs> so I be telling y'all to get out. I, I let you go to 30%. Anything outside of 30%, I can't be, I can't be liable for that. That's greedy. Anything over there is greedy. See, 174, 4% body fat. That's solid. How tall are you? That's right, Dre. Take it. 25%. We out. Y'all took mine. I'm out. All right, you see, 5'8. Okay, yeah, that's solid. That's solid. Scoop up nice 25%. Okay, let me get right that down. So I think everybody should have got at least 25% on this last one. So spy calls 25%. Let's go. It's a great day already. I love it. It's how we start the week off right. Let's get it. Let's get it. Okay. Um, I mean, honestly, there's a lot of... So I'm personally not looking to short the market yet. Yet. The only reason why I say that is because there's not a lot of resistance. You know, we're getting all-time highs right now. So there's not a lot of resistance. It's, it's going to be very hard to short the market. I'll be honest with y'all. So... Because we don't have anything up here to uh, balance, you, you got to be very careful. Got to be very careful to uh, trying to short the market. Now, some of y'all might want to hold a runner from today. That's fine. But for me personally, um, I, I'll be honest, there's, there's nothing up here I can do. Now, maybe I grab a pullback. That could be cool. Um, but... No, we're going to have to wait. We're going to have to wait big time. 17% got in late. All good. All good. So we got 28%. Good, good. 17%. There it is. So some of y'all who held runners, there you go. <laughs> some of y'all who held runners, there it is. All right. This is what I was expecting. So, yeah, that's good. That's solid. Solid, solid, solid. Um, Let's see. Let's see. This thing's a straight move up to. All right. I'm going to be honest with y'all, man. I don't know if I'm going to take a second trade today. And the reason why I say that, I was waiting on a pullback to buy it up. So we bought it up. Some of y'all may uh, hold some runners. That's up to you. But the reason why I say I'm not going to take another trade today is because 
you got to be careful with straight up moves. I, I don't like that. This right here, amazing to trade. I love it. This right here, I don't trade that shit. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I'm going to be totally honest. So this back here, where it goes down, up, down, up, down, up. That's an amazing trade. Those amazing times to trade, right? But straight up moves or straight down moves, I'm not touching this shit. So uh, <laughs> yeah, it don't look appealing, right? And so what can happen is this could just take us a slow grind to here. And so the only reason I would actually jump into this is if it pulls back, which it's kind of doing, if it pulls back, and then I maybe go buy some calls. Like I get into more calls. That's the only way I do that. The only way. Yes. So yeah, if you want to go zero DTE here, just for anybody who's like, hey, come on, baby, I need some more. Zero DTE, 484 strike price. Scale in number one could be like right in this area. I'd be okay with that. I'd be okay with that. And then I don't know if you want to hold it all the way up to here, but 40, uh, 484 strike price. And then, yeah, just, I mean, you could just throw some bullshit in, like something you already done made some money on. Just throw a little penny at it for trade number two, zero DTE, and just hold that motherfucker and see if it wants to get to the next resistance which is 486, right? 486. The only reason I'm okay doing that because once again, there are no sellers up here. Like the only sellers we got is right here at 485. It's the only sellers. Only sellers is right in here. That is your only group of sellers and they aren't that strong, right? So yes, I like the buy-in here. If you just have to do another day trade, We've, been, we've already made 25%. I'm cool. And I just locked in 10K. So I'm cool. I don't need no more for the day, right? But if you are in a position and you're thinking, mm, nah, I want more. I want more day trades. This could be another day trade. Now, my personal preference is we don't do more than two a day. So we already got one. So if you want to take this call, uh, I'll be okay with that. I'll be okay with that. And then, like I said, 20, 30%. You can decide to hold it after that if you want. I don't suggest it. If they close under here, I'm out. I mean, I'm not in it now, but I would be out. Close. Below. What is that? Close below 483.91. All right, so I'll put that there just in case anybody still is trying to trade because this motherfucker look like it's trying to make some move now. I ain't, I ain't trading no more though. I told you I'm done for today. But yeah, if you want to grab that, they got buyers. There's plenty of buyers now here as you see. Yeah, so those are your three scale ends. One, let me take this one off. So we got in right here. So one two, three, you scale in there and then you take it to maybe here. This is where your next available sellers are. I'll make this one red just so you know those are sellers. All right. And yeah, that's what I got. So buy zone, buy zone, buy, and then we'll take them to the sellers. There you go, Natasha. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Don't get your Birkins. <laughs> I'm actually trading now because uh, I got I got a little something I'm going to get. You got me a little something I'm going to get. And it's not real estate this time. <laughs> You know, normally I'm like lately, ever since I, um, ever since I met with Cody, I did a podcast with Cody, uh, the clever investor. And he said, man, we did a hundred million last year in you know real estate. And he told me we had that talk about watches and shit. I sold all my watches that day. I was like, bet. I said, if a motherfucker who making a hundred million dollars, 
if he ain't wearing watches and he like, bro, like put that shit in the real estate, bet. So I did that and I did like four deals <laughs> right after. Literally, I got out of I got out of uh Phoenix and we did like four deals. I was like, nah, I ain't fucking around. If he did a hundred mil, that's all I needed to hear. So I don't wear watches anymore. I don't do Rolexes and you know, I don't do it no more. <laughs> yeah, I sold good. Yeah. Sold at a good time. So yeah. Sold at a good time. So I sold sold my watches. Uh, I still am a car man. I still am a car man. Right? And the car I'm looking at. So I told you I'm going to get something a little sweet. Yeah. Now what I'm going to get is better than a Bugatti. To me. I don't like the Bugatti because the doors don't go out or up. If my doors are going to open just like regular people doors, why the fuck am I spending so much money? <laughs> I don't like that. There you go, Trail. You're getting close. But yeah, I need my doors to, I need them things to, you know, if my doors don't go up, then what the hell are we doing? I mean, I'm not paying you all this money for, for regular opening doors. <laughs> um, yeah, Andre, they don't. They don't. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, we we gonna we gonna do a little something, man. Made me want to get rid of my Chevy. <laughs> but no, 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 no. If I'm going to go buy a Chevy, it's a Chevy. Right? If we're going to go buy a Chevy, it's a Chevy. Cool. It's regular doors, right? I'm even cool when I bought a G-Wagon. It's a G-Wagon, right? Cool. G-Wagon at the most, even if you get like a big boy, 300K. Cool. It's G-Wagon. I, I can still look at that as a regular car, right? But when you start getting 400, 500, 800,000, a million, bro, what are we talking about? Why, why don't my doors go up? <laughs> why, why don't, yeah, the corn seg is nice too. Don't get me wrong. I like the corn seg, right? Um, but yeah, man, like, yeah, that's a fact, man. But yeah, like, I don't know what we're talking about. All right, everybody, if you took these scale ins one and two, you should be up right now. Somebody talk to me. How much are we up? You should be up right now. You should be up right now. Talk to me. Come on. I want to see at least 20%. Well, I say 15, 15, at least 15. There we go. So we got 18% there. We got, let's see, ES testing for 90. Took my 11% and ran. Good job. We got 23, 24%. There we go. I knew somebody should have been up 20%. There we go. Somebody got 10%. Somebody got 15% and out. Good job. So we'll go ahead and take this as our next win. That was good. So calls. Uh, I'll give y'all 18% on that one. I think for the most part, we were right around 50, uh, 18 to, I saw 24 and 23%. So I'll go 18%. That's two for the day. two for the day right and so you can <laughs> you can go and talk to your friends and your family members and things like that and you know some of them gonna hate some of them gonna hate oh you only taking these little bitty moves in the market motherfucker we made 25 and 18 percent right 25 and 18 percent you can't beat it you can't beat it how much just ask them how much did you make <laughs> right he I said, don't go talk to them motherfuckers respectfully. <laughs> for real. For real. Um, but yeah, like that's that's a solid, it's a solid day. See, we look like we're trying to break down. If it breaks down here, we're going back to test this area and maybe come here. So I hope y'all, hope y'all took your profits. Uh yeah, it's getting ready to fall. It's getting ready to fall. That should test show that it's resistance now. And then I'm expecting to move down. That should fall. Um, so yeah, I'm not shorting it because we already got our two plays for the day, baby. Don't 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 be greedy with me now. Don't be greedy on me. But um, but yes, that's a that's a great trading day, great way to start the week. So 122, January 22nd, we just did two profitable plays. I'm happy with that, right? 
Tesla is now moving for my people who have calls in Tesla. Well done. We just got to be patient with that. Uh, oh, baby, my coin is just moving. Coin is giving me the coin. Let me see what we got here. Coin is giving up the coins. <laughs> there we go. 32% up on coin. I'll take it. I'll take it. All right. Okay. It's good. It's good. Okay. I think coin can get as high as $200. I really do. I think coin can get up there to 200 bucks. Especially if Bitcoin start taking back off. I think coin will get to 200, 220 maybe. Could be wrong. But I don't think I am. <laughs> Tyrone said, I love it. I see what you see. Yeah. Tyrone, so you see the 200, 220? You see the same thing? Yep, yep, there it is. I've been in since 70, seeing 200. There we go. There we go. Was there a swing for coin? No, 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 no. I've been calling way too much shit. <laughs> and I know y'all ain't got the money to play all this shit smartly. So we got like four plays already. And I know y'all don't have enough money to scale into all four of those. So I didn't, I figured I wouldn't call anything else. At that point, we started getting into stock whoring te territory. You know, you start going around, you're just trying to hump on everything. You got some coin alerts? <laughs> oh, we got spot too? <laughs> so no, nah, man, we ain't gonna do no stock horn around here, man. We're gonna keep it, we're gonna keep it straight and focused. All right. For my new people who said they were new, um, how y'all liking it so far? All right? Is it is it what you thought it would be? Are you, you know, are you happy with being here? You know, I like to make sure my people are happy. All right. I like to make sure my people happy. <laughs> and Natasha said, are you not entertained? Yeah, you know, I like to make sure my people good. They like the vibes, most definitely, most definitely. Okay, Tracy, appreciate it. Secure the bag, yeah, that's the brand. And we get to the bag, these private flights.